Alright, so I just finished these guys' puzzle, now they'll let me ask questions. You two are employed at the factory. Would you say it's a safe place to work? Well, safe as any other place, I guess. Yeah, except the new wing is haunted. No, it isn't. You better quit listening to those hippies. Why do you think the new wing is haunted? When the factory expanded, we built a new wing. A bunch of locals got angry we had to clear out part of the forest to do it. Because spirits live in the forest. You mentioned something about spirits in the forest. Really? Depends on who you ask. You won't see me out in the woods after sundown. Well, me neither. But there ain't no spirits. Do you guys know what happened to the foreman? Yeah, the lobster bit him. Oh, Shut Jesus. Up, Daryl. What do you mean, a lobster bit him? He means Mike Lobb. Mike and Isaac didn't get along all the time. Had a little bit of a fight. That's because Isaac thought he was smarter than all of us floor guys. Well, he probably is. No, he ain't. Just because he's a college boy don't make him smart. What do you know about the guy fixing the sign outside? Randall Scruffman. Weird guy. He thinks the trees talk to him. Yeah, but he sure picked the right line of work. He's going to be employed forever. Stuff always needs fixing. I think he looks extra hard for stuff to fix around here. Yeah, so he can be close to Glory. She's the waitress here. Sweeter than moose milk in the morning. Never heard of that one before. Thanks, gentlemen. Anytime. Hi there, I'm Agent Tethers with the FBI. This guy's depressed. Sir, you seem stressed. Do you know something about the factory you'd like to let me in on? I don't know anything. Sir, it's against the law to withhold information or lie to a federal agent. Yeah, I'm into some stuff. So, what's your name? Steve. Sir, I'm here about the factory. If you've got nothing to do with it, then however you spend your time doesn't concern me. There's nothing you can tell me about the factory. I don't co-mingle with the factory folk. You haven't heard about anything suspicious going on, have you? Nothing more unusual. What stuff are you into? I airlift wooden gnomes out of Scoggins. The birds. To where? Why? How? Black market trinket rings. Big money. Couldn't you just use the mail? Loner Steve trains birds to transport freight. Tonight's shipment just departed, but Steve forgot to note the quantity. Can you determine the number of notes? Each type of bird has a certain weight limit. Each bird is shown carrying the maximum weight it can. Birds may team up on heavy and load, each carrying what he can, freight must be balanced evenly I think I got this one. 
it looks like these guys can carry two gnomes per leg, and these guys can carry one gnome per leg. So, I mean, this guy's got two. I mean, this guy's got one. This one's got four. This one's got three. And this one's got one. Oh wow, I was right. That's awesome. Alright, so we'll see what he says during the next episode. Thank you, thanks for watching.